in this whole demonstration of the uh, end antenna for 40, 20 and 10 as well as my uh, rig expert analyzer but first we're going to mount the mast which is made of two fishing poles um, they're only 8 meters but if you use two of them you can easily reach about 12 meters I've marked them somewhere oh yeah, yeah. sequentially so it should be not too difficult to mount them together which I'm going to do right now
Well, I've just uh, mounted the coax. It's a 17 meters long coax lying around on the floor. Um, and at the moment connected to my uh, rig expert AA170 antenna analyzer. You can also use a, a shorter coax, it doesn't really matter, but this will help uh, to give a bit of an inductive uh, uh, connection between the rig and the antenna itself. Well, let's see on 40 meters what it does. This is set to 7020 and uh, 1 megahertz range. There's a nice dip, but if we zoom into it a bit, we make the range a bit smaller, 250k, and you can see it's a bit out of frequency on 7020. In fact, when I tune into this frequency, about here. See if, it, if I'm correct. It's dipping at 7990, so it's a bit too long. Uh, now let's see if we go to. We close this. We set our frequency to um, 14 megahertz, 20 meter band. Or well, 14020. And the range. Well, make it. Well, that's a bit too large. Oh my God! And we say go. No, we go to SWR and say go. You see, it's a bit low in dip as well. In fact, it's really quite low, 13.7, more or less. And if you go to the 10 meter band, and we tune in for and go, you can see it's also a bit dipped below this frequency. So we can more or less conclude that the antenna is too long, the wire is too long, because it's di dipping too low in frequency. I've also downloaded it to my laptop screen using the software from Wikexpert. And you can see clearly that at the 40 meter band it's a bit low. And at the 20 meter band it's also a bit low. So it's, uh, oh no, this is 20, this is 10 meters and this is 40 meter. So it's, it's good to, uh, to shorten it a bit. And because all frequencies are a bit low, I would like to start to um, cut a bit of the bottom near the matchbox. Uh, because this will influence all bands and see what uh, what happens. Well, I've shortened uh, the wire antenna a bit, and as you can see, I've done it in a few stages, every time a few centimeters shorter. And we've come up to this now. When we look at the rig expert analyzer, set it to frequency 70. Uh, 7020. I hope it's visible. Yes, it looks okay. Nicely dips on the CW band of 40 meters. And if we go to uh, 14020 oh, and we run the same over here. Still a bit low. 
But I've got its multiband antenna, of course. I see my tips. Yeah, just below 20 meters center band. But if you go to the SWR on 14030, 1.1 .1. on 14010, well, should be okay. And if we go up in frequency up to 14050, well, still way below 1.2, so it's quite nice. Let's see what it does on 10 meters. Uh, set frequency 1st one the graphical view. Quite flat, below 1.5, should be okay. And if we hook it up to the PC, which we will do in just a minute, and we run the software from Wegexper, connects through a virtual COM port using a USB cable. The setup was quite straight forward. And we run a measurement ranging from 6000 to 30000 kilowatts. So just below 40 meters until just over 10 meters. At the resolution of 400 measurements, so it's taking half a minute to do so. That should be okay. There it is. This is the 40 meter, this is 20 meter, and up there is 10 meters. But 10 meter is still a bit below, but I'm a bit uh, nervous to make it a bit shorter, because if it's too short, then I can't make it uh, longer anymore without making soldiering adjustments or whatever. So I think I'll just leave it like this. And... Uh, I'll put the official connector again to the wire with the soldering iron and uh, we'll hook up the rig to see what it does. Well, it's now hooked up to the rig, my nice Icon IC730. Um, let's see how the SWR is on 7 of on 14025. Oh. Put it on AM without needing audio forward reflected looks very good seven oh two nine Same procedure. Well, flat out as well. And on 10 meters, 10 meters is dead at the moment. Nothing happening. And SWR on. 10 meters is, let's see it, well, 
one on 1.2, so that's okay. No problem at all. Looking very good. Only the bands are closed during this afternoon, so not much to do at the moment. <laughs> 